The women protecting children and preventing child abuse and neglect in our Commonwealth requires the participation and partnership of every Massachusetts citizen, business leader, and family service professional. The now therefore blah blah blah. Um, <laughs> proclaim the month of April 2015 the Child Abuse Prevention Month and urge all the citizens of the Commonwealth to take cognizance of this event and participate fittingly in its observance. Well, um, we actually started having a conversation a few months ago about bringing in an expert or an expert organization to assist us in evaluating the puts and takes of um, an Olympic bid for the Commonwealth. And uh, both the Speaker and Senate President referenced the fact that they brought in some experts to help them when they were going through the whole gaming process. And I, the most important point I would like to make to all of you today is how important those stories are when you're talking to people in public life, to people like Linda, to other people in the legislature, to be able to speak to them as you did and as you did from, from the heart and to talk to them about your experience and what it meant to you with respect to this particular program. And one of the things you're going to hear coming from our administration is attempt, uh, an aggressive attempt uh, to make the Commonwealth think horizontally and not just vertically when it thinks about how it can be a helpful partner with enterprises like this, organizations like this, and ecosystems like this going forward. This is the sort of thing that Armando does and does really well, which is bring together different communities that have shared interests and shared goals and shared objectives and gives them an opportunity uh, to spend some time with one another in a whole variety of settings. And their whole goal, their whole vision is to grow um, opportunity, to create opportunity and to create success uh, for a very diverse Commonwealth of Mass.